The BNA Income Tax Planner is one of the most comprehensive planning tools available today for calculating estimated taxes. In a moment, you will see just how easy it is to compute required quarterly estimated tax payments and record any payments that were actually made. For this demo, we'll assess the payments for a self-employed taxpayer filing a joint return and allocate income between resident state and the non-resident state. We'll use New York for the resident state and California for the non-resident state. You will also see that the payment of estimated state taxes in the current tax year will trigger an alternative minimum tax, or AMT, scenario. The BNA Income Tax Planner automatically performs quarterly annualization for purposes of required estimated tax payments. You'll find it easy to produce 1040ES and 1041ES estimated payment vouchers. And the planner also supports both regular and annualized income installment methods. As for state income taxes, the income tax planner automatically calculates and integrates these taxes for residents of all applicable states, as well as New York City and Washington, D.C., and non-resident taxes for California, Connecticut, New Jersey, New York, and many other states. You'll have access to special worksheets for state tax payment entries and calculation of state refundable credits, federal deductions, and refunds. Now let's try out the BNA Income Tax Planner by first creating a new client file. Simply click File on the menu bar and then New Client File. You're ready to start your plan. By the way, if you did have an existing client file that you wanted to work on, you would find it by clicking the Open Client File under the same tab. But for this demo, we'll start fresh with our new client file. First, select Assumptions to set up the basic information. Enter any assumptions and information that you may have for the client, including their name, type of analysis you want to perform, and so on. By the way, this is where you can see just how flexible and comprehensive the BNA Income Tax Planner really is. You can set up to 20 side-by-side -side columns of federal and state tax data for multiple years and scenarios. There are seven modes of analysis available to you as well, including years within cases, cases within years, adjustment, difference, taxpayer spouse, annualization, and minor child. So for now, let's select the years within cases option, where we're using the word cases to refer to an alternative tax planning option or scenario. This will allow us to compare alternatives within the same year. First, set the number of cases to 1. Then set the number of years to 1. Next, select the first year of analysis. In this example, it's 2009. Select New York as the resident state and California as the non-resident state. We'll leave the other values as defaults. Click OK to go back to the main worksheet. Once you're there, enter the number of personal exemptions you want to claim. Now let us enter the taxpayer's self-employment income. We access this by clicking on Ordinary Income from the main worksheet, and then clicking on Self-Employment Income. Enter $375,000 on Row 4. Next, we'll enter the spouse's FICA wages. To do this, go back to the Ordinary Income worksheet and click on Wages. Enter the spouse's FICA wages as $120,000. A 401k contribution of $10,000, federal withholding of $15,000, social security withholding of $5,580, and the resident state withholding at $5,000. Now it's time to allocate some of the taxpayer's self employment income to the non resident state, California. Start on the main worksheet and click on State Tax. Then click on Other Non-Resident State Tax. Then click on Non-Resident Source Income and select Yes next to Taxpayer Self-Employment Income. Enter minus $300,000 on Adjustments to Non-Resident Income. This will allocate $75,000 to California. Select the state tax, again accessed from the main worksheet, and click on State Non-Refundable Credits. 
On the State Non-Refundable Credits Worksheet, select Credit for Other Non-Resident Tax. Then, on the new worksheet that opens, Credit for Other Non-Resident Tax, select Yes to compute the credit and indicate if the credit is applied to the resident or the non-resident state. To see the effect on the resident state, select State Tax, which is accessible from the main worksheet. Okay, now let's focus on calculating the estimated payments. Note that at this point, prior to entering state estimated tax payments, the taxpayers are not in an alternative minimum tax scenario. But once the state estimated tax payments are made during the current tax year, the taxpayers will be facing AMT. Click on State Estimated and Withholding, which you can access again from the main worksheet. Once the new worksheet opens, click on the second row, Resident State. At this point, you will be in the Resident State Estimated Payments and Withholding Worksheet. Enter the estimated payments. For example, April through December, estimated payments of $40,000. January estimate paid next year, $1,791. By returning now to the previous worksheet called State Estimated and Withholding, we can click on the fourth row, Other Non-Resident State, and enter estimated payments. For example, January estimate paid next year, $6,319. Next, it's time to enter Federal Estimated Payments. From the main worksheet, click on Federal Withholding and Estimated. This will open the Credits Worksheet, where we will scroll down to the middle of the worksheet and click on Federal Withhold and Estimated Tax Payments. This takes us to the Withholding, Estimated, and Penalty Worksheet. We select Yes on the first row to compute under Payment Penalty. And for the demo, let's enter $5,000 for the refund for prior year. Next, we will select Yes on the Apply Refund to Estimated row. For the current year, first, second, third, next year payments made, we will enter $0 for the first year, $40,000 for the second year, and $25,000 for the third year. And we're done. Now, simply go back to the main worksheet where you will be able to see and review the completed plan. If any changes should need to be made, it's a simple matter to do so. With the BNA Income Tax Planner, you have all the resources you need right at your fingertips for assessing and recording estimated taxes including calculations for resident and non-resident states. For a full product demonstration, contact your BNA sales representative. The BNA Income Tax Planner is one of the most comprehensive.